just wanted to remind everybody. <laughs> um, I know masks are a tough thing. I hate them. I don't like wearing them either. Um, I do appreciate that I've been out in public. It seems to be more and more people are wearing masks. Um, but we just wanted to thank you for wearing masks while you're in the building. I know there's a temptation to come in and then sit down or go wherever you're going and take your mask off. But we do appreciate that we have people who are very vulnerable and just are very cautious about where they go and can't go anywhere unless people are wearing masks. So the fact that you wear your mask while you're in the building um, really helps us provide in-person experience for those who um, need to be around people wearing masks. Um, just so you know, today's one of those days, and I don't know what's going on, but I just don't have it today. Um, all the work that I've been doing is just a slog. So you'll have to bear with me while I'm trying to um, get through the Tuesday update. We did not have staff meeting today. Uh, we've had just kind of like a little back and forth about a few things, but there's so much going on and we're kind of taking a breather. We had about a three week, really heavy intensive run. So we're just kind of taking a break today. Um, but there are a few things that we wanted to let you know. Um, we are seeing more children and more students uh, because we are opening up for in-person. They're talking about what it looks like to do virtual. Like if you're not comfortable bringing your kids or students aren't comfortable coming, um, we're looking about what it looks like to create virtual opportunities. So stay tuned for that. Obviously we are in person on Sunday morning. We're seeing more and more people masked, uh, but it's great. Um, in person means a lot to us. Um, and then those of you who join us virtually, uh, we see you and we appreciate you um, joining us also. I've said this a bunch of times, don't forget the groups that we have going on. Prime Timers met today, which is our senior group. Um, our men's group will meet in a couple weeks. Uh, we have two different women's Bible study groups that are going on. We have a new small group that started meeting here. So if you're interested in seeing what it looks like to have relationships on a smaller scale rather than just coming and participating in worship, contact us and we will find a group that you can plug into. We have a lot of different things going on. We still need your contact information. Um, if you need some help in getting into Shelby, we will help you do that. And this is it. This is all I have to say. Last Wednesday at what we call the gathering, which is the first Wednesday of the month, we talked about the future of New Community Church. Um, we, we've had a lot of people who've watched that since we posted it. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. Uh, you will hear from our staff about what we think we want to be about, but we don't have all of the specific plans yet. Our staff and our elders are still kind of working through this, but there's three things that we know that are really important that we want to provide. The first one is content. What is some content, study, material, anything like that, that we can provide that would really benefit and help you just in your everyday life? Um, we know scripture and understanding of scripture, but sometimes we just need the practicality of some, of some things that can help us in all that we have to deal with in our life. So content's the first one. The second one is connection. Those are just touch points. How can we help you stay connected to us better? We know that us just flooding you with a tsunami of content um, isn't enough, and it's not what everyone's looking for. So connection, what, what would it look like to, to stay connected to us and each other um, that kind of help you in everyday life. And then the last one is community. And that is building groups who do life together that you really don't need us. We will provide content and we will provide some connection, but where you circle up with people who are at the same stage in life that you are, are looking to learn or understand the same things that you are. So we know community is our end game. It's what's really important. So watch the gathering. Um, you'll get some specific information from that. If there's any way that we can help you in those three areas, please l let us know. Um, I'm going to go get some coffee. <laughs> I need to do something to kickstart my mind today. So um, that's all you need to know for this Tuesday. Just stay in touch with us for the rest of the week. We've got um, some other stuff that we'll be posting. And uh, we will see you online. Take care.